Okay, so in supersymmetry, they have found error correcting code. It's like in the math equations of supersymmetry, you get ones and zeros, and there's like math in the equation that has an error correction. And then quantum computers right now, the big problem we have with computers, quantum computers right now, is that decoherence. Basically, the output we get from the computer is noisy. And we're writing error correcting algorithms to try to fix that noise in the quantum computer we're building. So, I mean, come on, and, and space is at absolute zero, and our quantum computers need to be near absolute zero. Really, they have to be at absolute zero, but I don't think we can generate that yet, if ever. But they're near it, and then we correct for that too. So, what is going on here? In my last video, I talked about how space itself could be a quantum computer in light of this, in light of everything I talk about on this channel. But every time you look, there's something new. Every time you turn your head, every time you wake up in the morning, there's something more and more obvious that you're just an avatar walking around in a computer. You know, physicists out there, can you guys start asking like the real questions? We're avatars walking around. What does this mean? Can we start talking about that?